Hello and welcome everybody. At the making of this video, my order is actually already on the way. I already got the email saying, here's your tracking number. It's going to be here. So hopefully the whole process, their website says right now their turnaround time is about two weeks and it looks like I'll get it in about that time frame. So we'll see. I'll, you know, probably make another segment here after I actually get the chips, but I wanted to record this before I actually get the chips, so I'm not biased by anything. So th on the left, this is my original design that I submitted. Obviously, I submitted the Adobe Illustrator file, not a JPEG. This is just a JPEG I rendered just for this video. So you can see kind of how it looks. You remember the design. And Crystal was kind enough to, got, to get back to me the same day I sent it. I sent it in the morning. I can't remember. It was like pretty early. It was 10 a.m. Eastern time. And I think they're working in Pacific time. So it might have been like, wow, like 7 a.m. or something. But either way, within the day, I can't remember how many hours it was, but Crystal got back to me and very professional, by the way, hardworking. And a couple of things that I knew were going to happen. They said the size was slightly wrong. So they made a little adjustment. So if you compare, this is the proof that they sent me, just the digital proof. You'll notice that they did expand these. Remember, with an AI file, I imagine it was pretty easy, hopefully pretty easy for them. So they expanded this a little bit, which I expected. Same with, they said, the rolling edge rectangle, just a slight resize. The other thing that I'm glad they helped out with was the text, the rolling edge. Because I, you can see my attempt right here, and I talked to you about kind of my concerns about that design. And like... Extra, like extremely experienced professionals that are just like, oh, yeah, let's try a bigger font, make it a little bit more bold, make it the typeset a little bit bigger so it's easier to read. And they fixed it. This is exactly what I want. So what I want with that, I want these, and this is kind of the key here. This is kind of the edge spot. This is kind of almost a negative space, but it's good for branding, which I want. I wanted this here, right? I didn't want just want dots. Same with this. And it should overlap perfectly. They got the spacing right. So it looks really good. This is what I should have been able to figure out on my own. But luckily, you know, BR Pro helped me out. So it looks good. This is exactly what I wanted. So for those of you not familiar with the process, it's, you know, you can establish contact with email saying, hey, I'm going to put in this order for such and such many chips. And then you pay for the order and you submit your design or approve the design. So in this case, when they came back with these changes, it was up to me to say, yes, I approve these. So, you know, I, you know, hundred percent approve this. This is exactly what I wanted. So I'm very happy with this design. Again, it's branding for my YouTube channel and website. So that's the order process. I pay for this with my own money. So I went through as a normal customer, no discounts. No, this is genuinely a set I want and no discounts, no free stuff, just my order. Okay, so full disclosure about all of that. I'm just, I just, I'm just a guy who likes poker chips. Look at what came in the mail. Stickers. Wait, here, wait, maybe you want to see this more than, do you want to see some, look, here's a, this didn't come in the mail. This is just one of my old ping torx bits for uh golf clubs all right we'll cut to the chase everybody's chomping out the bit already stop wasting our time on your mark get set look how beautiful this is so you can see this came from california tore some stuff come oh, oh yeah it's right here br pro poker i wonder what's in here lovely look at these promo chips i like how bold the edge spots are there's that nice blue look. Nice. I'm gonna open one of these up and have a look at the quality here. These look great. Yeah, I like it. The guilloche isn't overpowering. It looks good. Put this out, speaking of golf, put this out, use this as a, I love it. This is so exciting. Here, let me open up another one here. Look how beautiful this is. This is packed beautifully. I like it because there's not like excessive waste of packing material, but I ordered 600, so maybe you just have to order you know, in quantities of 600. Look at this, oh, look at that. The It comes out beautifully, the gradient on the edge spot. Well, I think so anyway. I like the way that looks. There are no whites or pink, so it should 
Yeah, let's see how dark the blacks look. Yeah, everything looks good. I'm super excited. This is the one that... Even the yellow, though. Could be a little bit more bold. But I love that look. Again, the gear shape pattern isn't overpowering. So there it is. There you have it. Or everybody should order custom ceramics. How could you not order custom ceramics? This is It's like Christmas. It's so much fun. My own hobby philic channel poker chips, everybody. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. I'm really happy with the way they came out. The 100. They look great. Which ones haven't we looked at? The green ones? See, I like the green because I didn't put a gradient on here because I want some progression. Yeah. One thing they did change, because originally I think I had, you see how they have, I have this uh, outer ring right here, this orange. Originally I had the text, this orange color, but they changed it to white saying it might look better. And I agree. I think it does look good with the, with the white. Beautiful progression from 25 to 100. I wanted to mention this. This is something that I'm aware of. Discussions that people have had in the past, you know, with, you know on, the, on PokerChipForum.com, people saying they don't make them like they used to. If you look closely, you can see that there are some lighter spots on the black 100s here. The faces look amazing, but when you compare like the dark face sometimes to how it can fade a little bit on the edges, on the rolling edge, something to consider. For me, it's not a big deal. I kind of accounted for that with the colors. It's like, it's very hard to mix these up. You know what I mean? It's like, it's pretty clear. So any of these other colors, the pink and the way I is. So, I mean, to me, not a big deal, but something you should be aware of, something I've seen a lot recently. If there's one, if you know of one manufacturer who never has this, let us know in the comments below. I haven't seen it, but I'm interested to read your comments. And <laughs> fuel the fire, did they make them better in the old days? Are these blanks just slightly inferior? And can you do better? I know I can't. Trust me, I've tried. All right, well, should we play a hand real quick? Because why not? All right, let's see. Let's throw some chips in here and see how they fare. What should we play with? Uh, these are the ones that aren't buried right now, so we're doing Copag. You guys thought you were almost out of this without playing a hand. Jokers. What a bunch of jokers. All right, where's my cut card? Here we go. All right. We are going to shuffle these up and test out our brand new custom ceramics. Who doesn't want custom ceramics? If you live your life and you're telling yourself that you are never, ever, ever going to buy some custom ceramics, let me know in the comments below. I'm curious how many people really dislike custom ceramics. All right, we are dealing two people, my friend and myself. And you can shuffle up at home. Pause the video. Run, grab your deck. Shuffle. We can play a hand here. Burn a card. Let's flop. Flop this bad boy down. Have a quick peek here while the camera's thinking about focusing. And turn river. Lots of commentary on that one. Unfortunately, as usual, things don't look great for me. Please don't have the ace. Oh, pocket king. How what how does this always happen to me? I run so bad. This is why we don't play real poker on YouTube because, well, I would just be broke. Let me know your thoughts. Custom ceramics. <laughs> I love them. I'm super excited to get these on the table and in play. Please subscribe. Stay tuned. We're going to get these out on the felt speed cloth, whatever this stuff is. If you would like to support the channel, you can support me on Patreon. I'm accepting general support. Thank you to my patrons, by the way. And you can also support me by visiting my Amazon shop. I'll put a link in the description below. I am an Amazon associate. I make proceeds from qualifying purchases. Thank you so much for watching. I look forward to seeing you in the next one.